coming for the 808. You so said you did a, you started off the YouTube with 160 beats. Right. Off of like, how long did it take for you to finally start seeing some traction? Well, I, I started, like, I tried to actually monetize everything because I was like, I want to monetize it through Google AdSense. Google AdSense hooks up with the email and, you know what I mean, it just it, it just helps out. Google AdSense is how you track mm -hmm. your YouTube, uh, you know, revenue or whatever. But, um, yeah, man, so when I started seeing the numbers going up, there was like a threshold that when I had everything from the Google AdSense, it's like, you ain't making shit, so how am I supposed to send you some shit? You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. But, like, as soon as everything's going up, bro, I'm like... I look at my, my, what is it? Something about, when you go to the channel, it tells you when they started everything. And it tells you how many people are coming across your page. It said like over like four, four million, five million or something like that people. But I'm like, there's only like 20,000 or maybe 15,000 people that subscribe. So I'm just like, whatever, you know what I mean? But now I'm looking at that and then the numbers just like, was just growing, bro. They just started growing and growing. And then I just, like every single song, bro, I was just like, you know what I mean? People were stealing my beats and then fucking it was getting copyrighted so then I couldn't actually like monetize. Everything was started going bad. And it was so much shit going on that like they just stopped my monetization. But at the very beginning for like the year, bro, that shit like, that shit went good. It was super good because it would just be like Google AdSense picked you out. I'm like, wait, what? I go to the bank and they're like, Google AdSense? Like, what do you do? And I'm like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm, this is like my first little time. It's like, I think it's like eight to nine bands or something like that that I just had in there for the year. And I'm just like, you know what I mean? That's my money. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm like, shit, let me go to the bank. And they're like, you know, I don't know. You know, so they're calling the other person. Everything's like going through. And they're like, you know, we'll, you know, we'll, uh, we'll do it. You know, this and that. And then it just went through. So they kind of knew that I was going, th going through them like after a while. But yeah, man, that shit started picking up. So to say, wow, what, a year? Yeah, yeah I would say like what, maybe like a, a year months. and a half. Yeah, like a year and a half. Everything started like picking up and then, you know, mm -hmm. shit started like working out. But I know a lot of people right now, producers are like, bro, if I do that, I'm going to be on. But it's, it's not the case. You got to you gotta stay consistent. I would say just like one beat a day if you can at least. Mm -hmm. I was doing like two or three beats a day, mm -hmm. you know, and three beats, an artist listens, they got three options versus one, you know, and it's, it was just always a beat, you know, and you didn't have nothing to do throughout that day. Just make three beats, bro. You yeah, know what I'm yeah. saying? And just post one up. But I'm saying the least just do make post up one beat. You know what I'm saying? And your shit's gonna grow no matter what I promise. Mm -hmm. It's just the algorithm. It's just the way you're staying consistent. That's that's just the secret. Staying consistent. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. That that's really it. There's not there's not like fucking anything else.